welcome to ITECO. In this tutorial, we will be looking in Java's main method, more specifically, what does words public static void mean, string, array, ax mean. So let's explore these words. So the public keyword is access specifier. It says that I am accessible to each and every entity outside my class. There are other access specifiers like protected, private and the default one that maintains the access only up to the package level. Now comes the static keyword. Static keyword helps in accessing the method without instantiating the class. Let's say for example if I am creating a method here say void start I cannot access this method like if I say main demo dot start since it is not static. However, if I say static void start, I can easily access the method as you can see. If I run this program, the program will be successfully executed. However, if I again remove the word static and run this program, you can see an error comes and if you look into the errors, it says non-static method start cannot be referenced from a static context. So this is the reason why in our class the main method is always declared as static. Now comes the void written type. So void written type says that I do not have to return anything from this method. Say if it had been declared as int or something else, it would have been necessary for the method to return something. However, being declared as void tells the main method that it doesn't have to return anything. Now the name of the method that is the main method. It is the starting point of any java program it is the only entry point to your program then the string parameters when you're executing any java program and if you want to pass any arguments say you are after compiling the program you are saying java main demo and and you want to pass some parameters like say a space b space c so what happens is these parameters are converted into string and passed into the main method in this way, you can access the parameters that are passed to the program. That is the reason why we have string array as the parameter here. args is the variable. This is the significance of public static void mean. It says that I can be accessed from anywhere. I can be called without instantiating my class. I do not have to return any value. This is my name and this, this is the parameter. Now, if you see, if I change the access specifier and if I try to run it you can see main method not found in class please define the main method as public static void main you get this error okay so the JVM tries to find the method main method with this signature and if it doesn't find it it throws the error even if you try to change any of this signature here you can see you get an error here So this was all about the significance of public static void main. Hope you guys like this video. Do click thumbs up, do subscribe for more such videos. Stay tuned. This is Ateco signing out.